Hello everybody, it's Tamaria, and today we're doing something a little bit different. It's a new thing I kind of came up with. I don't, I'm not sure if people have done this before. If I'm honest, I don't really watch Wild Horse Island content, I'm sorry. Um, but today we are hosting a game show. It's kind of like Jeopardy, today's trivia. However, I plan in the future to do this a few more times with a few different games. Um, so yeah, I am not confident that this will not be a disaster, but we are in a public server and first we gotta find at least three contestants. So let's go. I think the main issue is that I don't know if I want to do this in a busy public server or if I want to have them add me and we'll go to an emptier public server. Um, I don't really have the Robux for a private server right now. I've been using my friends that they lent to me. Um, so yeah, uh, we'll figure it out. It's fine. <laughs> There's announcement number one. Now we just wait. <laughs> what I think I'm going to do is for the first three, I'm going to have them stand at K, V, and E. And I am going to go down the line kind of like you do Jeopardy at school instead of the traditional game show. That way everybody gets a question, everybody gets a chance to answer. And I'm going to be honest with you, everybody is getting a prize regardless of if they win or not. So, um, yeah. It doesn't look like anybody in this server wants to participate, so we are going to server hop and give other people a chance. I've gotten a few questions asking why I don't just cut out the parts where people don't participate. And for the most part, that's because I easily could. But it's more fun to show you guys the process of doing this at the same time. I added a small limit to how many people I can have playing. The limit is going to be five, but we need at least three. That way I don't get crowded because I only have about nine horses I can give away for the trivia currently. The 10th horse I have to give away, well, 10th, 11th, and 12th are for the wheel spin at the end of this video. We have contestants! <laughs> Four of them! I'm getting them all to private message me so I can get our chats up on the screen. Okay, we lost one contestant. They PM'd the wrong person and got a little upset at me. So that's okay. We have K, V, and E, just like I intended. One in five, right? Yeah, one in five. Um, they picked breeds and coats. So I'm waiting for them to pick a number. They picked four. All right, let's get their question. Their question. Your question is as follows. This breed, added April 29th, 2022, introduced the Black Overo Coat, one of its natural rare coats. Giving our contestant a chance to think. <laughs> I'm, I'm doing my best to assist them because I know I don't host many game shows in this game and I don't think they've been a part of many. <laughs> Setting a time limit. They have gotten it correct. The answer was Mustang. Let's go. <laughs> it is now V's turn to pick a category. Also, we are all matching horses and I think that's absolutely adorable. <laughs> v has picked resources. Let's have them pick one through five to see what question they get. They picked three. Let's go find their question. The best ore prior to the Volcano Island update what this ore was and still is the main ore used as a currency in the trading community. This one's a pretty easy one. I just thought I'd throw it in here. <laughs> just to say, K currently has four points. V and E have none yet because they haven't gotten a chance to answer fully. I really shouldn't allow late contestants, but this is round one, so I'm going to let them hop on S. So we have four players again. They guessed the wrong or, so K, E, and S, though S is not at their podium, can now buzz in. So far, we have two guesses for lava or. Once again, the question is... Ooh, they're all saying prismatic. The question is, once again, the best or prior to the volcano update. If no one gets this right, nobody gets points. Everybody got this question incorrect, so nobody is given points. It is now E's turn to pick a category. They picked breed slash coats. This breed added with the addition of Royal Island. If you are lucky, you may find it with, find it with a pearl coat. Use it to make Pearl Sabino in the breeding center. 
And look, look, look at that. They got it right. Answer. And, uh, we just got to get them to stand at their podium. <laughs> Alright, this is working. This is going. <laughs> Let's see what they pick. <laughs> Let's have them pick a question. <laughs> This breed, much like its counterpart, Reverse Dapple Palomino, is obtained from Steven on Training Island. No, this coat. My bad. S has answered correctly. The answer was Rose Gray. Now it's Kay's turn. <laughs> Ouch! Too hot! This incredibly volcanic coat is obtained on all breeds via Volcanic Mineral Redemption. Ooh, they got it correct! The answer was infertile. Game mechanics for four. This mechanic, added May 13th, 2022, allows players to place two horses, a mare, and a stallion into the interface, producing a foal for a large amount of tokens. They have selected game mechanics for five points. This mechanic spawns a group of horses that the entire server may catch. Once caught, it doesn't consume your lasso. Very helpful. E has answered correctly and gains five points. Congratulations, E. <laughs> they have selected resources for four. Found exclusively on Lunar Islands, this resource is used in creating bright and flashy tack for your horse. One could say they make your horse glow. Our contestant answered Moonstone, which is not correct. V has answered our question correctly. The answer was Neon Flowers. Look out! Here come the flaming meatballs! Let's mine them and collect this resource we can turn into burns for prizes. You have 30 seconds. Their time is running out. V rang in first, and they said gold. Incorrect. Other players? Oh, that's just plays. Players, <laughs> you may ring in. They got... <laughs> it doesn't say ding, but they got close enough. Correct! Um, this was, I believe... I don't know how many points. <laughs> I'll have to check. The answer was volcanic minerals. All right, let me check how many points that was. S has gained five points. This breed, short and stubby, is one of the last low tier horses that have not been remodeled. They might even bring you some luck on St. Patty's Day. I'm gonna give it to them. The answer was Fjord. Ooh, they had theirs ready. <laughs> they want NPCs number five. All right. This NPC, with a very fitting name, is located on Volcano Island. Maybe if you give him some volcanic minerals, he'll give you a prize. You have 30 seconds. They got it correct! Good job! K now gains 5 points, putting them in the lead with 14 points. The answer was Burns. NPCs for 4, here we go! This NPC can be found climbing the highest peaks of Mountain Island. Sometimes you even have to return his tent to him from other NPCs. You have 30 seconds. This finished a lot quicker than I thought it would. K is currently sitting at 18 points. V is sitting at 8. E is sitting at 10. And S is currently sitting at 11. Um, we are going to go through our last two contestants. And then we will see who got first, second, third, and fourth. Oh, someone's gotta go. Oh no. <laughs> I'm giving everybody a prize regardless. So we are giving them the Overo Mustang. We've got another one. Um, so <laughs> we're gonna keep going. The contestant with the final question is E. We're gonna have them pick a category. Game mechanics. This last one is worth one point. During the Valentine's event, we are introduced to a seasonal resource. 
Every 15 minutes, this lands on a random island, allowing all players to harvest it for the seasonal resource. You have 30 seconds. <laughs> the They got it correct. The answer was Velvet Heart Meteors. All right, let's go. In third place, we have V with eight points. <laughs> Let's give out their prize. We are going to give them these. We'll give them these. <laughs> we are giving them the Chestnut Perch and the Overo Mustang. That is our third place prize. <laughs> In second, we have E with 11 points. We're going to give them their prize right now. We will give them, let's see, let's give them two, we'll give them one Overo Mustang and this gray Andalusian. And in first, we have K with 18 points. Please come collect your prize. <laughs> Trade them. We are going to give them this uh, Cremello Andalusian, as well as a second one. And just for just for fun, everybody gets an Overo Mustang. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. We still have our contestants and one of my lovely co-hosts here. <laughs> they weren't really co-hosting, but they were here the whole time watching with their little popcorn, so I will accept them as my co-host. Um, if you want to see more of this, feel free to subscribe, turn on notifications. You can turn them off later if I get just a little bit annoying. Um, thank you so much to my contestants. You were all lovely. Uh, I was right. This would be a little bit of a disaster, but it worked out. And I appreciate you guys so much. Um, if you would like a chance to participate in one of these, you can find me in-game. If you see me in a public server, come say hello. You might even see me advertising that I'm doing this. Come participate! <laughs> Um, following this, we will have my giveaway winners from the last video. So we're going to announce those right now. <laughs> I just thought it'd be fun to let these people announce the winner of the Clyde from last video. This is a little scuffed, but we're calling eh my co-host because they didn't get to play, but they were here watching. So we're going to let them announce one of the winners. <laughs> All right, go ahead. <laughs> Congratulations, not Leah. You are our first winner. Let's find out who wants to announce the next one. There we are, L family. You are the second Clyde winner. <laughs> um, I was trying to get a player who didn't have restricted chat, but I don't think I don't think any of the three Clydes along here. Um, <laughs> uh, doesn't have restricted chat. The final winner is Carter underscore Cam 30. Congratulations. <laughs> you are the third winner of the V2 Clydes. <laughs> Thank you guys. It means a lot to me.